particle physics often uses pictures to get at information about nature. And when we were building Atlas uh, around late 90s, 2000s, we started using digital image processing to get information out of pictures of the detectors, the sensors that we use for like precision alignment and so forth. When I learned about the problem of sound recordings, they're artifacts, they're on kind of uh, archaic materials that are broken and damaged in many cases. I sort of made a connection that if you could turn a sound recording, the physical object, into a picture, maybe you could get information from it. People didn't really think it was a serious idea. It was just a kind of a, an amusing notion. You know, gee, we could, we could survey sound recordings. Vitaly Fideyev, who was a postdoc in our group at the time, he wrote a program to take up enough points off one of these you know, records that we brought in to, I think, I don't know, a, a second or a couple seconds of sound. So then he came and he said, you want to hear some music? And I was like, what? And he played this thing and, and I was just completely taken aback that it actually works. It was one of those uh, experiences that you're just so surprised to see something like that happen, to hear sound from something that had just been an idea that you've been talking about in the laboratory, that you, you just, your heart jumps. You know, you, you, you only have experiences like that a couple of times in your life. <laughs>